So, just want to try something a little bit different. Um, first time talking on one of these. And I want to show everybody my 2020 M4 competition. It's my fourth FAEX with an E92 in the middle of it, came back. And I've had an M4 CS, but I think this one is now my favorite of them all, it's individual Mexico blue, which is obviously a Porsche color. Non-metallic. And it is just immaculate, like flawless. Since I've had it, I've put the M Performance height adjustable spring kit on it, which has really impressed me. It drives really good, almost as well as the CS. Um, no bounce, no sort of annoying rebound on dips, country lanes. It's just planted. And then I retrofitted the carbon ceramic brakes as well, which was not cheap, but haven't had them in the past, they are a game changer and I just love those brakes and they look incredible with the blue. And then the last big thing I did was fit the satin black 763M wheel and tire package with the Cup 2s and I think I'm just going to keep it mint and enjoy it as it is now. Thought about doing an exhaust, but it's an OPF car, so it's not as easy as sort of just sticking an M Performance exhaust on it. You know, and talk about limp modes and check engine lights and everything, and I just can't be bothered with that hassle. So I'd rather just keep it as it is and enjoy it how it is at the moment. But uh, yeah, it's everything on its original M Performance parts. Nothing. Well, there is aftermarket 10 mil wheel spacers but that is literally it everything is genuine bmw parts totally oem build show you the inside again literally factory fresh flawless Done six thousand two hundred miles. Opal white individual interior. Which is not easy to live with, but considering I hardly drive the car, it's fine. And it's also got the ultimate package on it, which basically give you every option from the factory, except annoyingly it didn't come with the full leather package. It's only got extended leather, so you don't get the lovely white dash. Thought about retrofitting it, but it's not worth the hassle and the cost. So. Hopefully that's given you a little tour around the car. Maybe see if I can try a few more of these and see how it goes. Thanks for watching.